All right, I'm heading to uh, Fred Myers from the North uh, Library. This is gonna be a little tricky just getting out of this parking car right behind me. Oh geez, I'm driving right into the sun again. It's like every time I drive, I can't see. Uh, uh, there's a couple vehicles. Three, four vehicles. Oh, one's taking a turn. Wonderful. Alright. So yeah, driving into the sun. I gotta take a... I gotta go across I-5. And then... Take a ride on the Interstate Avenue. So that's it. I spent all day on the internet. Really wasting time not doing anything productive because that's that's what lazy bums do okay so I'm on Killingsworth and I should be approaching I-5 I hope oh, whoa that furniture truck. Jeez, that was a. Alright, the uh, crazy driver just made a sudden weird turn in the road. Enough to get a person's attention. Yeah, that's why I think this, this area is a bit of a ghetto. It, but it's, it's so strange. It's like a mix of ghetto and white people. When I say ghetto, I guess you could say, I'm, here's I-5, referring to black people. Man, that's why I'm leaving. I'm not even going to attempt to to sleep anywhere in this area. That's why I'm going straight to Fred Myers for safety. Uh, well, an attempted safety, at least. Okay, North Interstate. Alright, that looks like the road. Yep, that's it. Alright, then on uh, Interstate... I'll see Fred Myers on our right side. Simple as that. And then there's another library just past Fred Myers. Oh, where do I? Where do I? Which? I take a right. Right, right in this lane, right? I hope to. Okay. Yeah, it's a strange little setup there. The islands are for trains. They're incorporating the train system. All right. So they got tracks that uh, separate the lanes. All right. So I'm looking for Fred Myers. Shouldn't be too far down. I'm going to attempt to sleep in the parking lot overnight and then go to the next library up further north and hang out from 10 to 6. Don't really have anything planned except I'd like to walk around. Oops, I guess I'm going a little slow. I'd like to walk around, get familiar with the immediate area around it, and, and then just. Uh, Upload whatever I find. Uh, Fred Myers. I just I don't want it to. S and I see that this Fred Myers actually has a parking lot too. Pretty wide open space. Regain control, and it's a gambling poster. car seems to be making a knocking sound. I should check the oil. There's a, there's a slight knocking sound. 
It's got to give out at some point. Been driving it forever. Alright. I could probably look at the street. North McClellan. If I pass that. Oh, that'd be the library, though. This one was on Lombard. So if I pass Lombard, then I'll have gone too far. Oh. Alright, so it's this Buffalo. Alright, this big building on the right looks like a Fred Myers. And it is. So I could probably hang a right and and park or get it and turn into the parking. Um, <clears throat> I think I'd be very interested in doing that. There's probably going to be a turn in for parking over here. As I thought I saw the that you can get some decent park spots on this side that are somewhat isolated and all that. <clears throat> yeah. There's probably going to be like no overnight parking stuff. I don't really see any information on not responsible for theft. That's about it. Yeah, they don't really have any signs that say no overnight parking. I'll just see how this feels. Okay, heading to the library. From Fred Myers. Fred Myers to the library. I slept overnight. I think the manager of the store parked next to me this morning. This is a very nice vehicle for somebody who works there. Oh man, that's... Seems like quite an active train was uh, running by the Fred Myers like every minute or something. I'll have to look at the map. Um, so I, I need to take Lombard, Lombard, and I think it's up here, this next intersection, Lombard, yep, so I want to take a left on Lombard, this is quite the train station here. Looks like the airport, it's not it's off to the right. You can see a plane just taking off. So that's this is a major intersection, Lombard and, and Interstate. Very busy. There's two gas stations on either corner. They probably don't have bathrooms for the public because of the bus station. Seems like a lot of businesses are turned off about um, allowing people to use the bathrooms uh, next to gas, next to the bus stations or the train stations even. <coughs> 
you always you always see more uh, highly uh, regulated uh, bathrooms next to the bus stations or gas or the the train stations. They just don't like the type of people that show up there or something. De gotta take a right onto Denver. Oh, there's there's a a sign. Okay, yep. Yeah. Right on to Denver, and it'll be before North McClellan. But there's no guarantee of a bathroom. I really gotta scout out around for that. Some kind of a sign or something for North McClellan. North McClellan should not be too much further. I'm not sure what street this is. Oh my goodness, is that the library over there? It has to be. So that's... That's the bank. I gotta get out. I gotta... I gotta take a look around, because that's that seems familiar off to the right. To, I'm gonna need to stop here. Um, doesn't look like this area is used much. Gosh, I need to I need to find a bathroom and then figure out where I'm at.